I'm good. How are you? Doing fantastic. Hey, we're American Whiskey Experience, and we already got our names out. Pete and James. We do. We do. We'll say it again, and uh, we're gonna go drink some Penelope whiskey. Penelope, Penelope rye whiskey. So this yeah, is a rye whiskey. Rye whiskey. Something different. So, so this is the first rye uh, from Penelope. Yes, it is. So this is a again a Penelope, a straight rye whiskey. I'm gonna It's pour. finished in a Tokaji casks. Mm. Now. I had no idea what Tokaji was. I thought it was a Japanese wine yeah, or something so, like so, that. So did I. So, Boy, was uh, I wrong. So Tokaji is a traditional sweet wine from northern Hungary. Mm, I'm hungry. It's made exclusively from uh, a medley of, of white wine grapes. Um, and it's uh, and the barrels are made from Hungarian oak. Right. So, Which I heard their oak is, is very strong. Yeah? Yes. Strong oak. So strong this is... Uh, Source whiskey, MGP, 107 proof, mm -hmm. age six and a half years, and the mash bill is undisclosed. Yeah, uh, which most of theirs are, and right? Th and this is a, is a pick, correct? This is a pick? This is a pick from Bev King in Norwalk, Connecticut. Yep. So we've which done Which does a done, great job. We've done a number of picks from Bev King. We appreciate, you know, everybody much. does. Yeah, all of them, yeah. Uh, I think we, uh, I think he's building an addition onto his house, and I think it's called the uh, we're gonna American Whiskey we're gonna Experience move in. Edition, because <laughs> we do we do enjoy this. Right, so we're moving in. Uh, so we're moving in. Um, uh, proof 107, right? You yeah, said 53.5, yeah. so, six years. So pretty, yeah, six years. So pretty interesting uh, barrel pick. Uh, I we've had this before. We both have tried this before. Obviously, by the looks in the barrel, Jeb James probably had it more than me. Uh, you know what? You might have. I really. I, I got actually. I had to call him to see if there's any more bottles because I would like to get this again. I don't think there is. I don't think there is. I'm sure he's got a couple hidden somewhere. I, I enjoyed it that much. Well, if we move, I didn't realize if, it. If, when if, you just said that, I looked at him like, well, oh. Well, if we move in the wing, then we probably have access to Probably access stuff, to it. So. Um, so this did survive two different um, storms. storms. So I yeah. think, I, was it, which, which hurricane in Jersey um, they so had? There was like a... Which was a hurricane. I can't remember which one. Yeah, there was a hurricane and flood in Jersey. Yep, and then there was a flood in the back of Bev King. Yep. And it survived two floods. Yeah. So uh, so interesting. So, so, so it's, it survived for us to drink, so it's great. Yeah. <laughs> and again, uh, Tokaji, right? Tokaji, is that how I'm saying? Tokaji. Tokaji wine. It's uh, from Northern Hungary. From Northern Hungary. And, and, and back then it was dubbed, and it says I'm reading it from the side, it's dubbed the king, or the wine of kings, uh, really? by Louis the, you know, Louis whatever his name, 13. Louis the 13th, 14th, whatever, you know, they have kings Louis, and queens Louis the dog. And stuff. Stupid having kings and queens. I should have a president. I should have a president. You, uh, could, you could have ours. You could, yeah, oh, shit. <laughs> I'll deliver. Uh, uh, so batch 51, this is the uh, copper series too, so uh, it's a new series, right? Yeah. Um, I'll tell you, I, I, no secret, uh, you like it? I, I I like it a lot. So I'm not even like I don't even need to spin it. It's that good. Oh wow, no spin. Color is oh, that's such a great nose. Yeah, it's a little darker. It is. It's it's a nice six and a half years. Yeah, it's a nice whiskey it's a, color. It's a copper series. Yeah, it's a copper series color. <sighs> so that nose is beautiful. Yeah. So I mean, there's just a a, a nice accent. Of rice spice, yeah, you know, and and followed up by like that musty sweetness, mm -hmm. you know, which you could you know tell it think, think from the grapes, obviously. You know what I'd like to do? What's Not that? to cut you off. I like to get uh, a wine, oh. a Hungarian sweet wine from Tokaji, um, Tokaji, yeah, barrels or taste whatever it? like that, taste it and see. That'd be cool. I'm, I'm assuming it's like a heavy dessert wine. I would think so too. Yeah, I think it's a sweet uh, dessert wine. Uh, maybe even thick, like it's gonna be like. Right. If we actually do research, we would know that. But yeah. we just drink whiskey. That's all we're doing. Right. right. For. And to get out of the house for a little. Pretty bit. much. I mean, we don't really. I'll tell you. I mean, like I said, I just, love this. The nose it, in this. It's a. I wish I knew. I wish we knew the mash bill. Mm -hmm. But the the rye spice is just is a nice, just like a nice layer. Yeah. Uh, not not overly like that ninety five five rye where it's bright spearmint. None of that. It's just good, good sweet spices. Sweet is coming off it. Um, I get confectionery sugar, powder. Do you? Yep, I get a little bit of that. 
that hint of mint. That yeah, rye get, mint. I get like an earthiness to it. Yeah, I can see a little earthiness. Um, but the sweet, I mean, it is kind of like mm. that, that sweet grape. I almost get like, um, like, uh, what's that, uh, like grape fun dip? What, what are you doing now? Drag it already? Yeah. Figures. <laughs> Figures. I did. Oh, well, cheers. <laughs> cheers. Fun dip, huh? Yeah, like, I just bought fun dip. That's a big word I can love on. I like fun dip. Right? I just bought a package of it. Yeah. Now is the fun dip is it is it the is it the stick? Yeah, of course. Yeah. That's exactly How what else it is. fun dip. Well that's 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 what I'm getting on that nose. That's exactly the, the, the powdered sugar type. Okay, yeah, sugar. yeah. That's the fun dip yeah. stick. Fun dip stick. If you know what that tastes like. Yeah, like if you put in a grape, grape yeah, powder, yeah. yeah. I don't know. Well a lot of flavor. Yeah. Um, I also get like some nice nice bouquet of flowers on the nose as well. Yeah, floral. A little bit. Hmm. Like I said, nice spring flowers, cold, cold or cold season flowers, spring flowers, somewhere around there. Just maybe because it's from Hungary and Hungry Hungarians. Maybe you're, maybe are you're, maybe, you're, people. maybe you're hungry. You want to? I am hungry. Right. Hungarian. I mean, they, they have, it's cold there in Hungary, right? I think so. Hungarian people. I'm sure they have some kind of summer. Everyone has a summer. I don't know. So the base of this is definitely. It's a really high quality, rich rye. Uh, I think the you know the finishing in that in the sweet wine cask uh, mellows it out. Well, I think it just adds a nice little accents of sweetness in the just little like I mean I you know I almost taste some like this is gonna sound weird, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Say it uh, like like fennel. Like some of that, you know, when you have, when you have like fresh fennel, um, and it's got sweet, but it's also got some like, you know, yeah, herb type, you know, like quality or something like that. Too. Yeah, 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 exa exactly. I think I get that. Yeah. Just, yeah, I get that. I get the, the fennel, the fenouk, the, the a little bit of dill, a very light dill on there. Yep. Um, I'm getting also a little bit of like. There's, there's, there's a lot in there, yeah, it, isn't there? It's it's a sweetness, but not like a candy sweetness, not like a. No. It's a dessert sweetness for sure. Um, is it? No, like I, I describe it like like the kind of the sweetness you get in fennel. It's got like a, it's, yeah, it's a vegetable, but it's got some sweetness to it. But as you well. bite into it, and yeah. you you get hit with like three different flavors at right. once, and then it, it breaks down a little bit, and yeah, you get and, a little bit of sweetness. And in the there. layer of spices, it just kind of goes. Spiceness. The spiciness. Spiceness. 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 Is that a word? No. Can we make it a word? You totally made that up. The spiciness is a new word that we are going to be using now at American Whiskey Experience. Write it down. Uh, it's. It mm. sits right almost at the end of the finish for me. So you get a little bit, and then all of a sudden it kicks at the end. And it's nice. It just, it just, it sits. It's there. a little earlier for me. Really. Mid, pa mid palate to the back mm. end, like just a nice spice medley. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm hitting it right, it's hitting it right at the end, right right there. Okay. Nice. But, Sour. lingers around for a long time. Uh, it coats the, the palate, the mouth, really the well. cheeks. Um, hangs out, a lot of flavor, a lot of layers. Um, and you, you drank this a bunch, so, I, so I'm, I'm assuming. No, I don't know. I, some. The, the bottle has a leak. So, uh, uh, defective. Can <laughs> we defective can we return this one? I do want to return it. See if you get a new one. You know what? I'm getting also too a little bit of a little like a uh, baking chocolate. Oh, okay. A little bitter, bitter, bitter sweet chocolate kind of thing. Yeah, a little me, bit. So let me ask you: so when you have sat there, because obviously you drank out the bottle, it's right. changed every time too. Has it a little bit? Like I said, when you, when you pour a big a big pour, I'm, yeah. I'm sure as you sip on it, you kind of. There's layers you dissect more and kind of like yeah. just sit there and just uncover multiple flavors. There is, like I said, I, I didn't I, I, when I said the the, the baking chocolate, uh, cooking chocolate. Mm -hmm. I didn't get that before. I'm getting it now. Um, you know, and sometimes I pair this with like you know some snacks and stuff like that, some pretzels and stuff like that. So when you need like a, a pretzel with the salt on there, it kicks them get a little bit more flavor. Okay. Uh, right. They're extra dark pretzels, so they're cooked a little bit, you know, crispier. So you get 
you know, a little bit of smokiness in there, but um, I'm not getting any of that now because I'm not having any snacks. Uh, I am hungry. <laughs> And, uh, the, the, the Hungarian barrel. Yeah. Tie it all together. Wrap. Bring it yes. all together. Um, no, um, this is loaded flavor, and I can't remember what. I think it was this eighty, wasn't it? Yeah, I, th I think everything we from Penelope is around that the seventy picture, the picture, to eighty-five dollar yeah. range. Yeah, I think I wanted to say something this is eighty. Uh, and there hasn't been a, a bottle that I've purchased oh, man, I've, in that range. Where I sat back and said, I'm disappointed. Shoot. Definitely not. Ten, fifteen dollars too much. Nope. nope. Not at nope. all. I mean, all of the picks we've had from Penelope yeah. have been phenomenal. I do really, recommend really them to uh, a lot of people. Their standard stuff that they they, they put out on the shelf is Yeah, the good. red label. Uh, all the, all the different very, batches the barrels, and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. Very good. Some great stuff. They got they got some really good batches out there. The four grain, you know, um, the four grain this, stuff is really good. This is this is uh, this is excellent. Th this is a. Uh, this is one that you sit, you go back to. You, I would actually, I think what I need to do is I need to pour it next time, write down what I taste. Right. On my nose, on the palate, on the finish. Okay. Go back to it a couple of days later, do the same thing, and I guarantee you, you it's like a, pick up more. it's an onion. You're going to peel it back. It's yeah. going to be more and yeah. more to it. I think so. I might take off something from here, you know, four days later, or a week later, add some. It, it's just, That's just the way this one is. Really, really good. Yeah. Really good. So, uh, definitely a winner. winner. And it's a rye. That's really cool. Yeah. So I, I'm looking forward to other ryes from them now. I'd like to see it. I wonder where they got the rye from. Well, it is MGP. It is MGP yep. for sure? Yep. Because I know that's where they get a lot of their stuff from yep. in the past. So I didn't yep. know if they were getting them. Just really, really good in my opinion. Definitely a win. We should ask. Um, we'll ask. We'll ask. Uh, but uh, I don't know. I, I don't know how much more to add. This is just really, really good. Yeah. I've been very happy. So it's. I can pour some more of it. You can pour some more. No, no, no. Um, yeah, it's got that. What's that? No, no I'm not going to say it. Okay. Well, well, thanks for tuning in. American Whiskey Experience. It's Instagram. effing good. It's, it's, uh, it is. it's effing good. It is. Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. Yeah. Thanks for checking us out. Yep. Appreciate the support. Penelope. Beverage King, check them out both. Kaji Wine Barrels. You did that right? Right, yeah. Hungry. Hungry. James is hungry. And I didn't make any comments. You know, did very well. You did very well this time. <laughs> Thanks again. This is our second time reviewing this, by the way. <laughs> right. <laughs> nice job. And you didn't even sing, it was great. Oh, I could. No, no, it's fine. Is it, I don't know. Wait, I'll, think, I'll think of a song. Think of next a song. time to do Penelope songs. Yep.